This is Jacob Miss Prime Productions here with another Transformers video review. Enjoy. This is Jacob Miss Prime here with another Transformers video review. As you may notice yet again that my webcam quality is a lot better than my old one. Today I will be reviewing Transformers Classic Ramjet. He's very a sleek looking jet to me. He's really cool. It's, it's really good. I'm glad I have this figure. There's his rep symbol. Um, now, this was a Christmas present for me last year. Um, it's really good. My regards to Santa. <laughs> um, to transform him, you'll just take the null rays off. I will give you a little close up of the Null Rays. Now, if you remember 2007 BotCon, uh, if you remember some uh, of the exclusives were used with the Ramjet mold, some were rep repaints of Starscream like Thundercracker, some uh, had um, one, I mean, one right and another right, and two lefts or two rights Null Rays, but um, the non-BotCon repaints of them have one right and one left. So, that's good. They do fire pretty far. But I'm, do I'm not going to farm all the way because I hate losing missiles. Uh, I do sometimes, but missiles, typical missiles, what can you do about them? <laughs> They're really good, though. Um... If you go underneath, you can pretty much see a little a gap that I can fit my finger, half of my finger through. Uh, um, now, if you can see, uh, those uh, where the black um, dots were, they flip up and become landing gear. I figured that out when I saw Matrix Prime review of this um, way back before I got this. Just going to fold them inward like that. Next, you're just going to extend, uh, fold in the wings. Now you're just going to flip the foot down. Um, I don't have G1 Ram yet, but he doesn't, from what I can tell, he is Three of the new uh, Seekers, which is Dirge, Thrust, and this guy himself. Um, I barely see any character of him because I've uh, seen half of Season 2, which is when he comes up. Um, but I have seen him a few times, but barely any character. Um, I think in um, Horace Goes to Hollywood, Episode 55, Transformers Season 2, I think we see him crash into a pond. I'm not sure... Maybe it was Dirge. I'm not sure positively. It's been a while since I've seen that episode on YouTube. Now, you see these two bits here? You're just going to rotate them like that. And then you're just going to take um, this, fold it down. It's the cockpit. And yes, his face is visible. He's a cone head. Next, you're just going to take the tip, rotate it around. Then you're going to. Hmm, I haven't done this in a while. I'm just going to open this, and then fold out the arms, and then you're just going to raise it up again, rotate it around, and shove it in. Then you're just going to. Fold it up once you get everything situated. Close the back up. Hold on. This can, can sometimes be frustrating. There you go. Now, uh, take out the little hands there. There. 
hands are a little bit tricky to get out. Though, though they are very detailed hands. But there's a lot of detail on the wings. Uh, but it's colored in so you probably couldn't see on cam. Even though the cam quality is pretty good now. Now there's two ways you can put the null rays. You could put them in his hand, but hey, any seeker, proper seeker that is, with null rays that go on the arm, which way should you put it on the arm? That's how everyone does it pretty much, because that's how a traditional transformer seeker should be. Like Starscream, a few of the Starscreams, like from, not Cybertron, Energon, I think, by no armada they didn't have proper null rays what they should have done is make holes uh, on the wings or on the arms to fit the null rays on but hey Hasbro's design new things whatever the Cybertron though does resemble G1 because they can be the wing it's attached to the wing and you can take it off and put it back on on the arm uh, sorry this is a really good figure. I hope you can find them in the store. I found them at my local Pomida, but they don't have any new Transformers, though uh, they only have like one or two Transformers left in there from the movie line, and they, I don't really want them. Uh, I may change my mind. They're Blackout and Ratchet, but when I saw this guy in, in my local Pomida last year, I saw Cliff Jumper, Mirage, Grimlock, and, and this guy himself. I um wanted this guy for Christmas, so got it sent to the drop off where Santa Claus would go and pick him up on Christmas Eve. So regards to Santa. This is Jacob Prime here with ending the Transformers video review. Goodbye.